What's up, happy gamers? We're here in the Keystone Monastery. We're going to do a quick save as to not reset our XP multiplier. Then we're going to cruise around and take out some enemies. Remember to keep your shelter spell casted so that you can... Oh, <laughs> that was the world's biggest jump ever in this game. That was hilarious. Come on, one more hit. Ah, he's eating my face, but it's killing him at the same time. <laughs> That's funny. Can't wait till we get our shelter spell up higher so it just lasts a few a few seconds longer. It's gonna be so sweet. All right, where's that marauder? Right in my face. All right, let's cast our spell here. Come on, marauder. I guess I could just let him hit me, huh? But that's not fun. I like being a little tac tactful. One more hit. Boom! Okay, let's pick up this item here. Another shelter spell. Yes, please. You know, I think you can come in, jump attack while they're running at you, and it'll interrupt them. I'll try to remember that next time. One, two, hits. You're dead. All right, let's open up this gate so we can go talk to the monk. Help him out. Stop the poison from spreading up his arm and... Give him a potion. Another, another yes please heal spell. It's great that this spell reflects damage back on your enemy. Ah! Look at that. He hit me and he's down half his life almost. Thanks to this spell. Open up. <laughs> right on his head. That's fantastic. Here we go. Let's go talk to this monk. Hey. You. What? Spot. Rip the wall. Too late. There's. You want heels. I can't. It's it. I'll do it. Yeah. And you want to have a potion available to give him so that he Thank will you. help you out later in the game with enhancing your potions. You collect Titanite. Titan hearts, um, and he does. He uses them to help enhance your potion. Here we go. Take this potion. All right. So you could go in these doors that are to the left or right of me, and whoops, <laughs> and do a side quest. You get you get a little bit of XP. I think you just get seventy five XP. Um, which isn't nothing, but, uh, so you go around and you look for some signs or whatever. It's not, it's not that important to do. We're skipping it because ultimately he just gives you a trinket that helps you find secret locations. And it's just kind of like, why they're all, they've all been found either in a wiki or, or I'll show you what's needed to be found. So who cares? And what we want to get here is the cemetery armor set. You wear all of this and you'll get a 20 to 25 percent i forget what it is um oh we only found three pieces in here so far that was the full set i'll look that up where's the last piece we'll find it it's going to be in one of these towers the south tower the north tower the whichever tower you want to call it tower Turn around, so I can kick at you. Can't get a backstab on this guy. <laughs> Take that. What do we get? Marauder's Great Axe. All right, let's go down here. Ninth night on watch. How could the Reaper get inside the sacred wall? I should cast my spell. Appeared out of nowhere. The graveyard is swarming. Whoa, whoa. 
need to alert the others. That didn't land. There we go. Okay. Oh yeah, there's a little thing to get right here. Oops. I'm afraid to like if I I don't want to roll off the edge there. I'm not sure if that can happen or not. That's what I was worried about there. Alright, here's a rune chest. And here we get. We get a rune and something else here. Live elements, live elements, live elements. Oh, attribute point shard. That's awesome. Okay. And then we get a connection up to this. Oh, yeah. Okay. So we're kind of overstepping here. All right. Head back out. You can spin that attribute point shard if you want. Um, actually, yeah. What do we... We want shelter to get up to three. We need a faith requirement of 15. But I think it's probably better right now to hold off and boost up our strength. So that our... We can actually get more damage over the over the line here. So Marauder's Great Axe is doing the most damage right now. I'm gonna do Butcher Axe so that's just a little bit faster. I'm gonna attack. Pick up the mysterious gauntlet. Okay, and then get ready to be annoyed by a rogue. And an archer. As if one wasn't enough. Ah, that was so silly. I like untarget locked or something. I don't know what happened there. Oh, that was a lot of damage. I don't want to use a potion. Because it's no fun using potions. Ah! I gotta use a potion. This is this is too risky. How much damage he just did, like with one hit. There we go. All right. Mighty antennas. Pick up the audio the note because those give you a little I bit of XP. And open this up just so you have access, even though we won't really be way. going down there. There's an archer and an infected lion, down there, but we don't need to deal like with them. Its bearer can wield it like a horrible weapon, but his soul must not be All right, pure. we'll a go through this dialogue here with Yekka. We're meeting her for the Where first time. Is Where is what? Back off! This doesn't. Mm. Don't drop him. You want. Seems it. I don't think that this. I don't think that this like has an, any effect on the game whether besides, she drops him or not. Not only steal my family valuables, but they've hidden the pathway. The pathway? The pathway. A door. Why you? It's in the. All right. I must. Suit you. She has a dagger that she wants us to find. I want to look at something for a second. Symmetry boots. Symmetry gloves. Symmetry. Symmetry. So we do have the full armor set. I swear that that only said we had three of them. Um, that being said, I'm going to go ahead and fully equip it and unequip the shield and see where we stand with our weight burden. So bad, huh? Okay. It's only 1750. Okay. So let's go level up our character. We're going to just walk through. Yeah, I'm going to use the checkpoint, level up the character, and put all my XP into attribute points for now. Well, why don't we just do four, see where that gets us, with endurance to bring up our maximum equipment burden. That strength brings it up one, maximum brings it up two. I think we want to go put, them, put the points in endurance. So there. At this point now, we're just doing... Oof, that's pretty that's too slow that's too slow let's do uh let's put another point in there in endurance how are we now it's still too slow of a roll huh i don't like to be that slow the game's just like kind of difficult and weird when you're that slow 
still. Um, all right. I thought that just yellow would get us to a good point. Anyways, um, let's put some more into endurance. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. I wanted to be in the gray. There we go, we're in the gray. Okay, now we want to wield the Marauder's Great Axe two-handed, if we can, and our weight requirements got knocked out of the way. So we're back in the yellow. Let's put another point in endurance. Excellent. Oh, ah, I want to do two-handed here. There we go. Okay, now our guy's super tough. Um, do we even want Yekka's dagger here? Yeah, let's see. Um, I'm just gonna check my notes for a second and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Um, I'm not gonna go through this whole tower area because there's nothing in there that we want for our build. Yekka's just gonna have to do without her dagger. So let's go in for this boss fight. Take out a Marauder. I thought that that would mess him up, but Watch no. Out. Oh yeah. There some freaks on your side of the gate. <laughs> Gotta remember to cast our shelter spell. It's one that I'm just like not used to. Come on, do your attacks. Okay. He's gonna get a hit on me, isn't he? <laughs> Got you guys. Okay. Boss fight. Not again. <laughs> Not again. Not again. Commander, right? Is that who it says? Smash. Only get one hit there. He's already calling out his homies. Still just one hit. Ah, oh, come on. Where's his homie? There he is. Anyways, let's put our uh, Shard of Heroes in this statue while that Marauder walks over. Hmm. My poise not good enough, or was it? I don't know. I didn't. I wasn't able to tell if I got the hit through or not. How about on this guy? No. <laughs> I wonder if I was on his back. Here now he's doing his animation, so we can get a few good hits in here. He will hit us here. Just stand back. Nice. That was sweet. He broke the statue, and we got some good hits in. You're not so tough, Commander. Here we go. Can we roll out of this? I thought he was going to do two. Sweet. We got two hits in there. I wish that we could take advantage of our um, shelter spell, but since we're just like a... We can't tank him without him just blocking us. There's just no point. Two hits. That's nice. I like that. Alright, now he's calling out his buddies. Another hit. Awesome. Okay. <laughs> One hit and his Marauder buddy. Okay. Let's cast our Shelter spell against the Marauder. Hey, I got the same axe as you. What a queen get ink. Get one? No. Don't get a hit there. Come on. No blocking if you want his unique weapon. Which I don't. I'm not gonna use shields. Here we go. Get a hit in. Another one. 
Yeah. All right, one more of those, and we're good. Do something. Who got me? I tried to double roll. It didn't work. Goodbye. Awesome. Didn't use any potions. I think I've only used one so far in this playthrough because of the shelter spell just being so powerful. There we go. Do we get the commander, tower shield, and a unique version of it? Okay. So I'm collecting his rune. Oh, and don't forget about the shard of heroes that we put over here. Let's see. Is this going to be better than the marauder axe at this point? It's a warrior sword. It has... A strength scale of 5%. Strength requirement of 14. See, I can't even wield it yet. Gotta get some points into strength, but we'll do that later, right before the Grave Lord, uh, Warshipper boss fight. So I'm gonna go over here, save, and uh, that'll end this video. Um, and let me think. So then the next one, we'll make our way down to fighting. Uh, war is it Warship? Warshipper? I think it's Warshipper. Down in the graveyard. Well, Happy gaming and thanks for watching.